the time is already here and we're unloading the grain bags. <laughs> So we've already got our corn sold that we put in these grain bags and uh, we're taking it down to the ethanol plant. We got started on one bag actually yesterday loaded a few trucks up. So I'll get a camera on it when we switch from one bag to the other. We're running around by the yard here. You can see we got this bag about half done. That bag there we haven't taken any out of yet. But we're filling the grain cart using the scale here to make sure we got enough to fill a truck. And then we're taking the grain cart in the yard and filling the trucks. The reason we're not just filling the trucks here is because it's uh, it's not very convenient to get the truck underneath that auger just because that unloader is always moving real slowly. So it'd be uh, kind of a hassle with two guys to move that truck around all the time to make sure you get it loaded correctly. And the grain cart, it just works handier. The grain cart unloads itself really quickly so once this cart is full we can have a truck loaded in uh, probably less than a couple of minutes. Uh, it's actually working pretty slick. We haven't had any issues with it so far. So we're hoping to get these bags empty, empty and off this field by uh, midweek. It's Monday now, so hopefully we can be done here shortly. So the basics of this thing without getting into it too far is that there are two augers that go across down there that are inside the bag. And then there's a knife right here that cuts along the bag real slowly as it pulls the tractor. So the tractor's in neutral running the PTO to run those augers and dumping up there. and the grain bagger that way. So the tractor's in neutral. It's pulling everything that way as it pulls the grain up into the auger. There's a gear drive in here and a chain and it's just slowly spinning this and it's using the bag to actually pull that tractor as it goes in and pulls its way into the corn. You can speed up and slow down the speed of that roller with this here, this takes it in and out, so now it's, it's not really moving, it'll stop there. That kicks that roller back into the gear, back into gear and gets it moving. So your controls are all right there once you've got the tractor going. So far it's been pretty slick, we haven't had any problems. We started uh, last night, got a few trucks loaded. You can see down where we started, by those tires, we're about, uh, well, we're probably three quarters done now, we only have Probably 75 feet left of this bag to go. Then we'll get on that one tomorrow. For those wondering why we're picking them up so early, they were only here for about a month. We actually had this corn sold four days after we put it in the bag. We're hoping between these two bags, there should be about 27,000 bushels. We picked up about 60 cents between local basis and different contracting that we did in order to end up selling it to our ethanol plant versus hauling it to our local elevator right out of the field. We're hoping after our cost of the bags and the cost of the uh, using the unloader and the bagger, we're hoping that we're still going to come out about $9,000 ahead. So it is a bit of a hassle. It's not real fun to do, but you know, I'll take a little extra headache for an extra $9,000. Thanks to the Minnesota State Patrol for reminding us yesterday that we have uh, an expired license on one of our trucks. We had to run to town and get a license for that, so we didn't finish this bag last night. So the plan is to finish it up today, get started on bag number two.
nobody ever actually taught us what we're supposed to do here. So I don't know if we're doing the right thing or not. We're just kind of winging it. School of hard knocks, I guess. This has potential to be the world's greatest slip and slide. I could set it from here right to town, cover myself in dish soap and get a run at it and slide straight into the bar. It took all three of the monkeys we've got in this circus to get this second bag hooked up. But we got it going, we are well into it now. We're actually over a third, a third done with it. So we've gone about 100 feet. We do have uh, about 40,000 bushels to haul this month. Uh, but we're getting close to about half that done now because we've taken a little bit out of the bins this week. So we're gonna get this done and uh, it's gonna be a good week. I'm the Millennial Farmer and this is Grain Bag Launch. It's hard to run in coveralls. <laughs> well that's a day for us guys. We're gonna come back and finish this bag tomorrow. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Facebook and Instagram as well. Thanks for watching.